Hello friends, <clears throat> my name is Muhammad Rashad and we are going to start a series of tutorials to learn Oracle Apex 21.2. <clears throat> uh, this uh, series consists uh, consist of a lot of tutorials uh, from zero to hero. So, uh, 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 carefully uh, listen all the videos uh, to be a uh, expert in Oracle uh, Apex. So uh, this is our first tutorial in which we learn how we can install Oracle uh, XE on our uh, local system. There are uh, two ways uh, to learn uh, Apex. Uh, first one is uh, you can create your account uh, on cloud for Oracle Apex and second one is uh, you do all the installations on your uh, local machine. So uh, I will cover all the uh, ways uh, but uh, in this tutorial I am going to uh, show you how we can install Oracle Database XE on our uh, local system uh, to save our time i have uh, installed uh, uh, oracle xe on my local system and uh, made slides uh, so that uh, we uh, can uh, keep this uh, video uh, short because installation takes uh, too much time and we uh, don't have time to uh, make a very a large video. So uh, let's uh, start. First of all, you need to uh, install, uh, uh, download Oracle XE from the site. Uh, right down here. Uh, Oracle XE. And here we have uh, a link of, and here we have a uh, download Oracle XE uh, database. Uh, so here we have multiple options. So 21C Express Edition for Windows. Uh, if uh, you are on Windows, click on this link and you will get uh, Oracle database 21C Express Edition, which is latest. Uh, version of Oracle Database XE. After downloading, uh, you have to unzip it and double click on your uh, setup uh, uh, file. After that, you will see a welcome uh, screen uh, uh, 21C uh, Oracle Database Express Edition. So click on next. When you will click on next, you will see uh, this window uh, accept the terms in the license agreement so uh, uh, accept and uh, click on next after that you will see uh, where you can uh, where you want to install your uh, XE so uh, clicking on change you can change the folder where you want to install your Oracle and database XE so I have uh, installed it in C app HP Oracle and then uh, 21C. Click on uh, next. And then you have to uh, provide a password for your sys system and uh, PDBA admin accounts. So uh, provide uh, your password and uh, remember it so that after installation you can uh, log in uh, to your uh, database uh, and after that you will see a summary uh, uh, where uh, is uh, Oracle home uh, path of the folder and then you have Oracle base folder and then click on install when you click on install it takes uh, 10 to uh, 20 minutes to install uh, Express Edition on your uh, local system. So uh, uh, 
after some time you will see uh, windows uh, firewall uh, blocker screen uh, which is uh, you can see uh, this type of window so uh, click and click on allow access then uh, you will see uh, when half of the uh, database is installed uh, uh, a smaller window which shows 7% uh, complete, 29% complete, 30% complete and similarly uh, after uh, some time uh, percentage of uh, numbers will be increased and at the end of the installation you will see uh, uh, Oracle database installed successfully and the last uh, uh, line of the uh, this screen is uh, URL of your EM uh, if you want to use your EM click on finish so that's it your database uh, installed on your local system successfully now to make sure Oracle uh, database actually installed successfully or not you need to open your CMD and then you have to type SQL plus press enter and uh, okay uh, uh, here you have to provide a password sys as sys dba and the password you used uh, when uh, we were installing our Oracle database on this local machine so type the password and press enter so here you can see uh, you are connected with your Oracle XC so uh, that's it for today and in next video we will uh, install our Oracle Apex and uh, ORDS Oracle REST data services on our local machine